Hi everyone, this is Obi-Wan, and this is my LEGO Star Wars review for the Jedi and Clone Troopers Battle Pack, based on Episode 2, released in 2018. So this battle pack is a little bit different than what would normally be released. You do get the two standard clone troopers, which you'd expect, but the two unique minifigures you get with this kind of means there's no point buying this as a battle pack because you don't need multiples of them. Saying that, it is a pretty good battle pack though. And also episode 2 is probably the film that has the least amount of sets released from it. I'm not really sure why, because there's some good vehicles, characters and locations from this film. The mini build that's included in this set I think is supposed to be based on the Republic gunship and for a battle pack it's not too bad, it doesn't really look like the gunship but I've seen battle packs with a lot worse builds than this one. It comes with the two standard stud shooters at the front and a small gun on each wing as well. And now on to the minifigures. So probably the highlight of this battle pack is Barris Offie. She has been released in two previous sets, which would be the Republic Swamp Speeder and also the Clone Wars version. This is a much improved version though. That Republic Swamp Speeder was released back in 2010. And although the overall figure looks pretty similar to that one, but rather than having the legs that she had in the previous set, she now has a dress piece instead. She has pretty good detail on her torso. She also comes with a cape and a hood. She also has an alternative face. And here you can see without the cape on, the back detail. Next we have Ki Adi Mundi, it's been a long time since we've had him as well. The last set was released in 2011 and I believe that's the only one that's been released so far. The face print especially is much improved and it looks much more realistic now. The torso detail is also pretty good, as is of course his headpiece. I think I would have preferred to see one single unique headpiece though rather than having it in two parts. And finally we have two standard clone troopers. I believe these are the same ones which have been released for a while now, I don't see any difference with them. So that's it for this video, overall it is a pretty good set, you can't really go wrong with these battle packs and although there's no point buying multiples of them, it's still definitely worth picking up, especially for the two updated minifigures. And of course it's great to see another episode 2 pack finally released, I hope LEGO release more soon.
So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a thumbs up. If you have any questions, comments or suggestions, please leave them below. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos.